So let's discuss those two crucial issues. You mentioned that the price is important, as well as the price range. What is a greater challenge for people who are now thinking of researching EVs? So the price has always been. Since 2019, we have conducted this study once a year. Due to the epidemic, we had to postpone 2020. But the top three worries have always been price issues, range concerns, and where people will charge them. However, fewer people are becoming concerned about prices. That is less of an issue now. It has decreased over the years that we have been doing this study from, oh, 42% of respondents this year. That raised some alarm. It was 49% last year, and that was just one year ago. So, in a good timeline, we can see that has obviously eased tremendously. Tesla's stock price might reach $2,000 by 2027. According to a revised price estimate established earlier this year by ARC, Invest CEO Kathy Wood. However, a lot of people have commented on this because they disagree with Wood's prediction that Tesla's stock price could increase by that much in just three years. So let's examine it critically. Do you believe Tesla will reach that level by 2027? We think it's highly likely to happen, especially if Tesla experiences its major triggers before that year. You know, one fascinating topic for thought is Tesla's distinctive position within the fast-growing EV market. In addition to being a pioneer in this field, the company has repeatedly shown that it has what it takes to be on the cutting edge of innovation and lead the pack. Therefore, there is a great chance that Tesla's stock price will rise in the future. Let's hear from the analysts. He probably has to pull a rabbit at this point, and if so, I wonder if there is one that can be seen. Is it true that Tesla really pioneered this change toward the North American standard plug system? They own it and use it in their network of superchargers, which is currently being adopted by other automakers. Additionally, they will all switch to his plug standard. If Elon can continue to expand that infrastructure, he might be, you know, the one who implements the subscription model, where he'll start to receive all of this money from people who use his network to charge their cars as frequently as or more frequently than any other network. Therefore, even if I don't think the product side is very promising in the immediate future, I believe the longer-term infrastructure play could be quite beneficial for him. And these new initiatives by all these other manufacturers to migrate to his system, his plug, and his supercharger network could really end up being much bigger and more significant in the long run. For a number of reasons, investing in Tesla is recommended. First, consider the market for electric vehicles, as well as leadership and vision. Elon Musk, the CEO of the business, has a history of success with previous businesses like SpaceX and PayPal. Over time, investors have become quite confident in his leadership and his capacity to disrupt sectors. Because of the growing global emphasis on sustainability and lowering carbon emissions, and because Tesla is a pioneer in the EV sector, the demand for EVs is anticipated to increase dramatically over the next few years. This puts Tesla in a position to generate significant future sales and profits. Welcome back to Tesla tomorrow, gentlemen. Due to its well-known brand and dominant market share, Tesla is well positioned to profit from this trend. With a share price of $2,000, the automaker would have a market capitalization of $6.3 trillion, or roughly the same as the combined market capitalization of the three most valuable firms in the world, Apple, Microsoft, and Saudi Aramco. Tesla bull Kathy Wood and her company ARK Invest predicted Tesla's stock will perform well in the future, setting a $2,000 base case scenario for Tesla's share price in 2027. At $1,300, a bearish prediction is made, and $2,500 is the bullish aim. Despite the fact that these are extremely bull forecasts, she would provide compelling evidence for her position. And in a moment, we'll get right into them. But first, if you enjoy this kind of information, press the like button, subscribe, and enable post alerts to be informed about what Tesla is doing. Kathy Wood is a big enthusiast of the stock market and her flagship ETF, which she continually monitors for the next big thing on the board, has historically made many investors millions of dollars. For the time being, nevertheless, Wood had estimated that the stock price may reach $4,600 by 2026. She had previously forecast that the stock price will reach $3,000 by 2025. Wood did not merely make these forecasts for the shares of Tesla without justification. 
ARC's prediction for the company's robotaxi or driverless ride-hailing sector, which projected $200 billion in revenue from the business in 2027 in a gloomy scenario and $613 billion in a bullish case, was what drove ARC's high hopes for Tesla. According to ARC, Tesla may make $1.02 trillion in income by 2027, which would be achieved annually. Its robotaxi division will provide 25% of that. Additionally, it forecasts that by the time Tesla's enterprise value reaches $6.1 trillion, the robotaxi company, which has the potential to be a tremendous driver of growth, would account for 58% of that total. The company recently revealed the findings of a series of simulations estimating when Tesla's robotaxi might go into production, and the results show that 2024 seems to be the most likely date, which is exactly in accordance with the company's past assurance and recommendations. ARK Invest has grown more optimistic that Tesla will soon begin offering the robotaxi service. The late 2024 launch date was added to the modified Monte Carlo model as the weighted average of all possible launch dates. The fascinating part is that ARK has a longer-term outlook, supporting the prediction of many Tesla bulls that the company will become very successful soon. However, excluding Kathy Wood's anticipation for the robotaxi, the FSD service from Tesla may potentially be a significant driver. Through the licensing of AFSD, Tesla has always sought to hasten the development of sustainable transportation. The carmaker may hasten the acceptance and implementation of autonomous vehicles, which would improve traffic management efficiency and make roads safer by drastically reducing traffic accidents brought on by human error. Data collecting is another important component of this, especially for Tesla. Data is essential for enhancing A-driven systems like FSD since algorithms need a ton of data from actual driving to learn from and get better. The diversity and volume of data that Tesla could gather would increase significantly with the adoption of FSD in many more vehicles. This might result in quicker and more thorough system enhancements, thereby hastening the development of totally autonomous vehicles. This might significantly broaden the application of Tesla's FSD technology. This plan might integrate Tesla's technology into a wide range of automobiles, spanning different market categories, from premium to affordable. Thus, Tesla's technology may spread even further, affecting how autonomous vehicles are viewed and received around the world. Tesla has a wider range of products than any other pure play automaker, and if it discovers as much value in autonomous vehicles over the coming years as ARC, Invest anticipates its stock could soar to the firm's target price of $2,000 in no time. Tesla is developing a self-driving robotaxi, which according to ARC, may end up being the most valuable component of the entire company. These autonomous cars would not require any human involvement and might be the key to bringing new markets to life, such as autonomous ride-hailing, which ARC estimates could represent a $14 trillion market opportunity by 2027. According to the investment firm, Tesla's potential robotaxi business line is a crucial driver, accounting for 67% of predicted enterprise value and 64% of EBITDA in 2027. In 2027, EVs will generate 47% of all revenues across the simulation set, although at significantly lower margins than robotaxi revenue. While Tesla's stock may still be inexpensive, Things are about to change for the better since Tesla is poised to make enormous gains in the next few years, fairly soon. How do you feel? Please share your opinion of Tesla with us in the comments section below. Click on the next video on your screen if you're interested in learning more about what Tesla has been up to recently. Hello the re.